guys welcome back to my channel I'm very excited for today's video as you can tell by the title it is an office tour so I'm in my office right now first off apologies about the lighting I know it's super dark and not my usual bright kind of videos I guess the lighting in this room is honestly so bad I have to use all like artificial lights we have one big window um, but it's covered by these beds so you literally getting no sunlight or no light whatsoever anyways now that I just got that aside welcome back to my channel um today as I said yeah I'm filming an office tour I am so excited about this ever since I made this room my office I've been wanting to do an office tour I have not been able to get around to filming this because honestly this room has just been a mess for the longest time because if you don't know I own a clothing boutique Zeta boutique um, and when you own a boutique I swear to god the room is just never clean um, so I feel like I finally got it into a place where it's like relatively clean honestly this room is going to change so much uh, so it will not stay like this I'll probably film updated office tours when I like change it around and stuff but for now this is how it looks Alright, so starting from behind my door, I have my whiteboard here. This is my monthly whiteboard. I have not put anything on it because I'm lazy. <laughs> um, but this is my meal plan here. This is where I keep either a gym plan for the week, a meal plan for the week, um, or anything I need to do for the week. I keep it on this sheet here. As you can tell, I've got my lunches, dinners, and my grocery shop because I went grocery shopping today. So that's behind my door. I then just keep my handbag there. So this is the section down here. This literally just has my um, ottoman. I love it so much. It's so boho and so me. So I keep my planners on top of it. This is just my daily planner and this is my weekly planner. I honestly have so many planners, uh, but I'll show you them all in a second. All right, moving on to the main space. This is honestly where I spend all my time. <laughs> um, so I have my display monitor, whatever you want to call it here. Uh, and this basically plugs into my laptop and I can work on my laptop for the keypad um, and it displays it on the screen. I don't like the keypad I had before so I use just my laptop one. I find it so much easier and I can use the like touchpad as well. Um, I just have a candle here. This one is just a citrus candle um, and this is my daily water bottle. I try to drink quite a lot of that. <laughs> um, I then just have my MacBook here. Um, over here I created this little display. I have a coastal book. Um, it's just kind of like one of those design books where you just like flick through and it's just a bunch of like house design. Um, this candle here is honestly my favorite thing ever. It is so big um, and I just love it. I next have this vase that I stole out of the living room <laughs> um, and it is just this white ceramic uh, vase and it's got these like what do you even call them? Little plant things. Um, this is my poster. This is the probably only piece of artwork really that I have in the room. Um, I love it. It's so pretty. It's so artistic. Uh, and yeah, that is my desk. I honestly just love my desk so, so much. Probably my second favorite part of the room. These are my kind of clothing displays. Obviously, I have a clothing boutique. Um, so I like to keep some of the new arrivals that we have on display and then the rest I keep tucked away. Um, but yeah, so these are some of our new arrivals. I basically just hang them on this hanger that I got um, up there. This one here is a smaller version. It was literally just a kid's version, um, but it matches so perfectly with the bigger one. Yeah, I just use all these like wooden hangers. It's really annoying because I have like all wooden hangers and then I just have these white ones, but I can't be bothered changing it. And then on the wall, I literally just keep two hats. I just feel like it adds like a nice little touch of decor and I feel like everything looks so plain on this wall so I really like that. So behind this rack here I have a printer that is my printer that I use for all my papers um, and just like anything like that. Next up we have my jewellery holder. This is all um, some of the samples that we got for Zayda's jewellery. Alright so under my little shelf thingy I have these two buckets these currently have the scrunchies for Zeta in it um, they are just on these like little oh good example they're on these little card things um, I've just got these in here for now here until I create the section in this room for accessories but I'm just waiting for the rest of the accessories to come in and all the um, like display card thingies um, but yeah so underneath the shelf here I keep all my planners so these are all my weekly planners, my social media planner, my time blocker planner, 
um, everything like that. And I also keep some cords, but that's not interesting. I won't show you that. Uh, and then on this side, I also keep my gratitude journal. This is the weekly planner that was underneath my um, whiteboard. Um, and I just keep a binder for like tax stuff and all that other boring stuff. Alright, so this is obviously some more of the new arrivals. Here I have my um, label printer. So this is where I print all of my labels. It's already plugged in and ready to go. I just connect it to my laptop and I can print out a bunch of labels. Underneath that, under the shelf, we have my poly mailers. So I have a bunch of just normal sized poly mailers. And then behind it I have some larger ones, which are down here. I'm probably going to make another video that's um, dedicated to like organising your small business supplies. I don't know, something along those lines because I'm going to be getting a whole bunch of new packaging supplies that's why a lot of this is not fully organized or fully clean um, so I basically have to wait for that okay so coming down here I have these two like little basket things the top one here just has all these uh, whiteboard markers pens whiteboard rubber thingy a lighter um, I got these like little mar uh, whiteboard markers for my monthly planner one and then I've got the big ones for my big whiteboard um, and then the one underneath it, it's a bit of a mess, but I basically just have chargers. I've got my tripod. Um, this has like some sewing stuff, just like really random things in there. I forgot to mention, but the office that I use is actually our spare bedroom. So um, it has some bunk beds in there for our spare beds. However, um, I obviously use it really as my office, uh, but I can't ch change those. So the side of the office is just actually so disgustingly ugly. I'm not going to show you it, but I will show you under the bed because I keep a lot of data stuff underneath there. I have this bucket here. This has some of our samples for our jewellery and accessories. I've got some samples in there. Um, I then have my cords just for my, what do you call it, sewing machine. This bucket here has some tissue paper, so I've got like all these packs of tissue paper. I've got more spare poly mailers, these ones I don't like to use because they're really bad quality. Um, so I keep these for my like selling account and I just use them for like, yeah, things I sell second hand. Um, and I try not to use them for Zeta because I just don't really like the quality. I then have these buckets. Um, these buckets basically just hold a lot of stock. I honestly don't have that much stock at the moment. I am quite low. I've just got basically a bunch of stuff. These ones are organised. So everything under the bed is all sale items. Um, so all of these items are all on sale currently. All of these ones as well. Um, so yeah, these are all part of our sale section. So when people place an order, if I can see it's a sale item, I already know it's going to be under the bed. Um, if it's a new arrival, it's obviously right in front of me. And if it is a full price item that's obviously not a new arrival or not sale, it's going to be in my stock closet that I will show you in a second. Then finally on this side here, I just have this um, box. And this has all of my art supplies. So every art thing I do, I keep in here. Um, I just like playing around with art supplies when I get some time. So down here I have my sewing machine. Um, so that is just down there. And then this is my stock closet. It is super empty at the moment. Um, and it's not very aesthetically pleasing. But <laughs> basically you can get a little bit of a view in there. I pretty much just have all of these pieces that are all full price. So I've got some hangers. I've got more in the car that needs to go up. I have my DSLR, I've got um, my labels over there, this is my stabilizer, I've got my lights for my soft boxes, I've got this hanger, I mean sorry, shelfing, um, and this has all the full price stuff that aren't on sale, um, and then down here I've got my soft box uh, lighting stuff and just some tripods and all that fun stuff. Alright, so that was a really ugly closet, but um, basically I have to keep the stock somewhere. Alright, moving on to this side of the room. So I have my little mannequin here. This has just a set that we have from Zeta. Um, it is just this cool designed mannequin thingy. I don't even know what to call it. Um, I have this like, this was actually a table runner from Kmart, but I hung it up as this wall decor and I love it. I have a little parrot down there. Um, and then I have the shelving unit that has four of these like flexi baskets. 
I'm going to go really quickly through what each one is. I won't go into detail because I said I'm going to be doing a video all on organization. Um, and that's going to be all to do with small business supplies and all that kind of stuff. So the first one here, this is all of my packaging stuff. It is a mess, but it honestly gets messy so easily. Um, so that is everything that's in there. This one here just has some of this color sheets. This one here has my white sheets for photos and all that. Um, and then the bottom one here has all my tech supplies and just random bits and bobs that I really don't want to show you. Then we have my mirror. This is where I take all my selfies, um, everything like that. And then down here I have my rubbish bin, um, which is just this basket from Kmart that I use as a rubbish bin. So that is basically my entire office. I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, I will obviously be filming quite a few of these in the future because this office is not going to stay the same. Again, apologies about the lighting. I know it's been terrible. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you do, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you guys in the next video.